All right, welcome back, everyone. Time for heat three of the four SS juniors. Did they all make their way round? And heading through pub. Now down onto sinking straight. And over the line they go. All break the timing beacon. And that is all registered so in one sebastian simonelli two maxwell and rebelt three jet saragi four chloe lane five troy bowden six robbie forrest and seven having just broken the timing beacon is jackson duong all righty here we go then who will be victorious in this one. We are ready to go for SS Juniors, heat number three, the pre-final. We are live on Facebook once more, and Simonelli is going to lead the charge of the 4SS Brigade over the line, and away we go, Saragi. Watch oh, yeah, tried to go up the inside, but then got balked and has gone back to P4. So it is Simonelli who leads the way. Sebastian got the whole shot. Through he goes. Oh, it was rebelt into two. So we lane to three. Round they'll cut there back towards me. And Simonelli got a cracker start. Round he comes in. Simonelli it is who leads. Rebelt into two. So we lane to three. Power Republic. Jackson Duong trying to hang on to them. As they go down, sinking straight. Heading through DPE now. Into JG Cart with the leaders. And still, Simonelli. Rebelt. Lane. Bowden. Saragi, Robbie the Rocket Forest, then Jackson Duong. Through Better Benz, already gone the leaders and back towards me coming through the Project X. Chicane, as they flash past the whole freeway here. And that looks like it could get very interesting as Bowden holds Jeff Saragi at bay. But Jeff Saragi tried to make a move and Robbie Forrest could make that back. Forrest on his tail, Saragi holds him at bay at the moment, Bowden in front of them and hanging on to them and they close up on the brakes through DPE, now the three of them head through Vordio, into JG car they go, the three leaders are away, Simonelli, Rebelt, Lane, then this battle, still Bowden, oh Troy holds but Saragi went to go inside there and had to yield, so couldn't quite make the move. Bowden, Saragi, Forrest at the back, Jackson Duong. Through goes Simonelli. Rebound, Lane. Still that three-way battle with Jackson Duong chasing them down into Power Republic. 52-927 for Jackson Duong. Can he get into a 50 second lap? Let's see how he goes. This time round will be slightly quicker once more as the sun beams down on the circuit. 51.8. We want a 50 from him. Through they come, all through. JG Carr onto Wash It 1. Then they're going to Wash It 2. Robbie the Rocket Forest is going to drama. Oh no. Robbie Forrest got a problem. He's got a mechanical going on. Simonelli from Rebelt, from Lane. Saragi, whoa, yes, you had that. Saragi had that. He was already even further. He was more than alongside. He already had the nose in front. And for some reason, he let Bowden off the hook big time. Troy Bowden did not take the foot off the brake, I'll give him that. He wasn't gonna stop. Troy Bowden was uh, not letting up and 
Jeff Saragi thought about it and then very quickly backed out because in that chicane there isn't really room for two when the door is being closed on you. Simonelli leads. Three ball in two. Chloe Lane in three. Troy Bowden in four. Jeff Saragi in five. Jackson Duong, seven, Robbie Forrest with a problem. Jeff Saragi, closing, closing, oh he's gonna run, he's gonna run, he has gonna run, Saragi goes up to P4, Jeff Saragi, and now Troy Bowden's gonna fight back, yes he does, Bowden goes more, they done it again, side by side, no, it doesn't go through there, don't go side by side there, and still Bowden slugging it out, now again, Sarag is going to look up the inside, but doesn't go. Back towards me comes Simonelli. Then Rebel. Then Chloe Lane. Here come the battling pair once more. It's a duel. It's Fisty Cup. You name it. It's on like Donkey Kong. Sarag again. Oh, no. Very nearly side by side. But again, Bowden holds him at bay. Do they go through pub? Saragi's got to come back in him once more. There goes Chong Jackson holding on. Robbie Forrest has got a problem and he puts a thumbs up. He knows he's got a technical, cannot do anything about it, unfortunately. And he will have to just come back to try another session. Meanwhile, Bowden has got all the attention he doesn't want. Simonelli goes through, leading. Rebound in two. Chloe Lane in three. Here they come again and again. He's caught him. Bowden once more. And Saragi looking, looking. Oh, doesn't go. Stays where he is. Saragi once again just holds on. I think he prefers to get him down the base straight away. In they go to pub. Watch for Saragi's run now. Down Sinkins. Saragi. Yes. Once again, Jeff Saragi goes up. Oh no, side by side. They're still side by side. All the way into JG Cut. And eventually, Bowden had to yield. Saragi was not letting up. He just kept the foot in. And he held him off. Through goes Simonelli. In he goes to Power Republic. Simonelli. Back towards me now. Following him still, Maxwell Liebelt, then it is Chloe Lane in three. Behind them still, Zaragi and Bowden. Troy Bowden now coming back at him again. Troy Bowden jumping up and down in the seat. He's not letting up, Troy. He wants it back. There goes Jackson Duong. Jackson, the P-plate to remember. 52-7 last time round, there is Robbie Forrest. Continuing on, not giving up, never say die. He could get a place. Back with the leader though, Simonelli. Unstoppable in this one. And Sebi has been way, way, way out in front of Maxwell Rebelt. And Maxwell, I don't know how you pronounce that, Rebelt or Rebelt, I love it. So Maxwell. Uh, I may get pronunciation lessons after this, but I think it sounds great. Maxwell Rebelt is in second, Chloe Lane third, Saragi still four, Bowden still five. It looks to all be sorted out. Here comes Jackson Duong. Through he goes in six, seven, Robbie Forrest. Still got the technical going on. And still something not quite right down there at the right hand side of the motor, he's still playing with it. And still, Simonelli leads. That's one. The three ball, that's two. Chloe Lane, that's three. Still four for Jeff Saragi. And Jet, the DPE number 30, 33 driver has had a cracker and got himself up there and is hanging on. Bowden looks to be beaten. I think Bowden's going to have to settle for fifth. 
Huang is definitely settled for six because Robbie Forrest is away off him. And the car does not sound like it's firing properly. Jimenez is. Here. He is comfortable. Rebound follows him through. Chloe Lane now follows them both. In she goes. Into Power Republic and onto Pub. And they see one to go. This has been the penultimate Heat 3 race. And it is finally all sorted out. Cadet 12 to come. And then we will be into our finals. But this is going to be another cracker victory to Sebastian Simonelli. He nailed it all the way around. He got it right. He backs it into Power Republic one last time. Give it up for your four SS juniors. A thumbs up from your winner, Sebastian Simonelli. Thumbs up from Rebel 2. He gets P2. Chloe Lane gets P3. Well done to them. And Jeff Saragi, hats off. Brilliant stuff for Jeff Saragi. Thumbs up. Gets himself P4. Well done to Troy Bowden. A great battle for P5. And Jackson Duong, the P plater, continuing to improve. Well done to him. Comes home behind those leaders. And poor old Robbie. Comes home last, not what he deserved. And that was your 4SS Junior Pre-Final.